A huge merger could cost hundreds of Bay Area residents their jobs. QVC is buying St. Pete based home shopping network, which is also known as HSN. ABC Action News reporter Adam Weiner shows us what this could mean for thousands of employees as well as you at home. This is it. Okay, so five flex pays for decades. It's been a staple of cable TV. Only now there may be three flex pays, but for its 40th birthday, the home shopping network is getting married to longtime competitor QVC. Their president, Michael George, says both channels will continue for the foreseeable future, but in some ways will combine forces. We need to align some technology uh, platforms. We need to negotiate new arrangements. Negotiations could mean good things for shoppers at home. They can go to their support suppliers and say, we're going to buy all of these things, but we would like for you to reduce the price. Abby Hall Blanco is an assistant professor of economics at the University of Tampa, and she says those negotiations could lead to lower prices as HSN and QVC compete with companies like Amazon. Now I can buy something on Amazon and have it sometimes at my house later in the afternoon. That's providing a new very important source of competition for companies like HSN and QVC. Companies that don't innovate don't survive, says Blanco. I think retail caught off guard by that little thing called the internet. Which is why she's optimistic when she hears QVC's president say things like this. Folks are experiencing QVC or HSN not on a traditional TV platform, but over the top through Roku or on an iPad. And that could be good news for the long-term stability of HSN employees, about 2,500 of whom work at the St. Pete headquarters. The deal is worth over $2 billion, or the equivalent of just 100 million easy payments of 1999. I'm Adam Weiner for ABC Action News.